empty shelves across the country, the fear of not knowing when or if much needed supplies will arrive. Supplies such as hand sanitizer, desperately needed in hospitals, in care homes and in schools. Where hand sanitizer was able to be found, it often came at an extortionate cost. Chemical manufacturing company Robinson Brothers responded to this with teamwork and determination, altering their output in a matter of just a few weeks to produce and donate 6,000 bottles of much needed sanitizer to their local community. More recently, we started providing kind of 10 litres, 20 litres to the to the the care home so that they can use it themselves to wipe down equipment, wipe down beds, all that kind of stuff. So that's kind of how it, but it all happened very, very quickly because it had to, because the, the challenge was imminent. Each of the 300 staff members stepped up to this challenge, boosting morale in the company and in society. When Robinson was asked if anyone needed hand sanitizer, I thought of my sister, as she works as a ward sister in an A&E department, and she's been dealing with a lot of COVID-19 patients. She's really grateful to Robinson Brothers for the box of hand sanitizer to help keep her and her staff safe. How much do the thank yous that you've got from the community mean to you and your team? Honestly, it made us all 10 feet tall. For somebody to take the time to say, we really needed that, thank you so much. It really does pull on the heartstrings, but it also makes things worthwhile. You know, you see all the stuff that's going on. There's so much good still left in the world. And Robinson Brothers' actions are evidence of this good. So you've received lots of thank yous, but you've also got a thank you of your own. It's a thank you from me to all our employees for actually stepping up to the mark, keeping the pressure on, and I mean just not bending under all the pressure. Two words that right now mean so much to so many.